glass is such a difficult material to describe. It's really unforgiving material. You really get one, maybe two chances to do something right. You don't stop turning and you don't stop thinking and moving and engaging with the material until it goes into the annealer. My name is Ryan Thompson. I'm the shop lead at the Greenfield Village Glass Shop. I got into art at a super early age. I was always drawing Batman and, and Barnes, I think, was like the first things that really got me inspired. When I got into elementary school, uh, I found music. I started studying percussion. I was always drawing, but music just became everything. When I first walked into the glass shop at Bowling Green State University, there was a team of maybe six or seven people all working together on this giant piece of glass. There was fire coming from every direction. It reminded me of music. It reminded me of a, a band and they just all, you know, find their voice in it. And it was electric. That was just the beginning of the rest of my life. In 2021, I took over running the Greenfield Village Glass Shop. That was a super amazing opportunity and the only one that's topped it since was in 2023. I was selected to be on season four of Blown Away. It was really intimidating when I first got there. I was surrounded by so much talent and expertise. You know, you immediately realize that like, it's anybody's game. The process really leveled the playing field. I learned so much about blowing glass that I, I didn't think that I would. I thought that, you know, I would go there and I would do what I could or what I can, but being in that environment with a clock ticking and a team of assistants who you've never worked with in a shop that you've never worked in forces you to slow down. There is definitely a balance between moving quickly and rushing. The show has helped me find the middle ground. I'm most known for making Venetian style goblets. This way of working with the material is the most exciting for me. It's a difficult area of glass to uh, be, be masterful at. There's a lot of differences between what we make here at Greenfield Village and what I pursue as an artist, but the reason that I think that this job has been just so influential to me is that it's based in the tradition and skill involved in producing functional glass objects, which is, you know, at the root of what I do, the reason I do it. And I love being part of the lineage of craftspeople that have been here for a long time, a long time. And it's, it's really special. The team at Greenfield Village is absolutely amazing. I feel so fortunate to work with such a group of skilled and dedicated glassmakers. Glassmaking is a language that's like taught through doing and through seeing, and the culture surrounding the people who have dedicated their lives to doing it is just, uh, it's amazing. Yeah, almost chokes me up to think about it. If I could speak to younger me, I would, I would tell them to just stick with it. It's not gonna be easy, but it will be worth it.